Hello and welcome to the Easy HR Weekly Roundup. It's a roundup of all things HR, so you can concentrate on what you do best, and that's running your business. Um, so this week, there's no changes to anything in employment law. It's a quiet week, and we always appreciate that. Uh, however, what we have seen is a couple of reports that have come out, which are actually quite interesting. These relate to recruitment, salaries, and returning to the office. So there's been one report come through from KPMG and the Recruitment Employment Confederation, and they've done, uh, they've surveyed uh, recruiters to understand kind of how, where they are in the marketplace at the moment. And they've come back and said, actually, recruitment numbers are at the lowest since March 2021. Uh, at that point, numbers are still fairly high. But it seems to suggest that actually, um, the, the need to recruit is slowing down a bit at this moment in time, which you take superficially from that number. And what's quite interesting is if you kind of couple this in with another report that's come out this week, which has come from Resources Solutions, uh, they've actually uh, surveyed some employees and they're finding that a third of employees have only had a pay increase in the last 12 months, which would kind of fly in the face of what we're hearing more generally in the news at the moment. And additionally, they're also saying that 42% of employees are looking to return to the workplace to combat the cost of living increase. Now, what this seems to suggest is actually people are now starting to batten down the hatches. Um, what we're seeing is that employees are starting to prioritise job security over anything else at this moment. So I appreciate that's a big leap and situations are far more complicated than that. But we are starting to just see some subtle changes in the marketplace. So I think for, for you as employers, it, I think you've got a bit more latitude to deal with situations at the moment and dig into kind of what people want and need and what support they, they require. So I'd say kind of look at things. It doesn't prevent the need to actually look at salaries correctly and actually where you need to look at pay increases or you need to do things differently for individuals, consider that. But I think there's certainly not that grown swell of activity that we were seeing previously. I hope that's useful for you for this week. It's been great to speak to you. If you need any support with any, any HR advice, the links in the bio or in the comment section below we can be of help and even if you just want to chat we're always here take care we'll see you soon all the best bye